There we go. Uh, we accidentally started the last one with Marie Curie, and while I think Marie Curie is excellent, um, she's uh, pretty good in the opening game. It's just like Freya Stark, though, like can always travel to a desert region. That's new. Hunting rifle, same as Frederick Courtney Sellis, very useful weapon. Bedouin, a cook, a camel. Seems pretty much purpose built from the beginning. Yeah. I say we give it a shot. Yeah, I, I agree. Plus, I love Freya Stark, so here we go. Uh, yes, statue, likeness, whatever. Amelia Earhart, H.P. Lovecraft, Fred and Courtney Sellis, and Richard Francis Burton. All right, it shouldn't be a problem. It'll be okay. All right, uh, the dead end desert or the grasslands? I think it's the desert. Seems pretty straightforward Fairly to me. Fairly obvious. Uh, the crew had the things, pot of tea, missionary, sure, you can come with us. And we're going. All right, easy enough. Let's not die. Let's not die. Uh, Okay. Pretty much the same cookie cutter opening. And that is the village we have to get to, which costs us nine of our ten opening water. Dang. Seems fine. Do we fill water when we go to towns? Nope. I don't remember. Nope. Need uh, need uh, uh, other places, oases for that, which is what the Bedouin is good for. Just like we have to level <laughs> him up. And find it. And find it. That also. Yeah. I haven't delivered the missionary. Do we want to try and recruit somebody? Yes, we yeah, have an extra we might slot. As well. Nobody wanted to join us. Good. All right. We'll Thanks, try guys. And trade with them. We'll get rid of these because we're not going to ever need them. And they're, they're worth basically nothing. Basically worthless. Shovels, though. Shovels, though. We'll keep one just in case. Cost and flares. I don't see as being particularly useful. Oh. They really like look. Look. The, the the button next to cancel. It increases our standing by trading with them. Or if we could just give them stuff. We could just give them stuff. And increase our standing. And increase our standing and then, in, then recruit people. Right? Oh, probably. What's our standing right now? Zero. Oh, yeah. So if we throw that in. All right, let me see how finely I can adjust it. I've j I just took a bunch of stuff away. Taking one away of everything ultimately didn't impact that. But taking anything else away at this point will. So I'm going to go ahead and... Huh. I, I actually really like that. I Maybe that was present in the system before, but yeah, I never noticed maybe it. Maybe it was. Um, I'm going to get rid of the rope, the cost and flares, and the shovels because I don't think they're useful, and I'm going to get stuff that I do care about. Yeah, that actually might be useful for getting water, too. Yes. And then if I ditch a torch... There. Nice. So I still get three torches and the standing plus two bonus, and I get rid of all of the useless items that we have. That's actually pretty good. Is that enough, or should I go for, like, the mangoes? I personally would go with the mangoes. Okay, I can, I can get three mangoes and still get standing plus two. Is yeah. that good enough? Yeah, I, I, I think that's good. Yeah, and I'm just going to go ahead and eat those right away, and then I'm going to try and recruit. Nice. And now that our standing is two, I can get somebody. Uh, so I'm going to go ahead and get somebody. I'm going to get an animal handler this time instead of, okay. a, instead of a warrior. Um, Zitadasu, or... Yep, Zeta it is. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, caught up with the trek the very next day. Whatever. I'm going to eat those things because they go bad pretty quick. And I guess... I guess here we go. Let's see if that's an oasis. Oh, cancel. That's probably... Oh, uh, that's, that's the, the pyramid. pyramid. Holy okay. shit. Okay. All right, so we know that's the pyramid. All right. Great. Uh, let's see if I can refill some water and maybe do a little bit more adventuring beforehand. Oh, we got attacked by a bird. Uh, all right. Might be okay. Eh. 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 Huh? If you can get an eye. Oh, damn. Luckily, these two combo together. Ooh, nice. For a tactical advantage. How about that? All right, uh, that's all six. Oh, Jesus Christ. Ooh, well, they're going to cook. Uh, birds. Birds. What are you going to do? They're so dangerous. Birds. Oh, we should have kept that Stable eye. Stable position or tactical advantage. Yeah, because that would give me a better shot here. Fuck. I just don't have enough... Uh, 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 oh my god. Well, maybe it's a good thing we're by the... Yeah, the by the oasis. Yeah, yeah or, or yeah, by the pyramid. All right, uh, evade, okay. In the round. Oh, people are dying. Oh, so many people are dying. Oh, I'm no. running, I'm running, I'm running. There goes everybody. Oh. I always do this where I get into these ridiculous encounters that I didn't need to get into. I'm running. I'm out. 
I'm out. I'm just. I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna get out of here. It'll be fine. I'm it'll so be, it'll be fine. He stayed behind. I don't know anybody but the. <laughs> I showed up with like four people and I was like, these people will be useful. And then they died and now I have a camel. Great, great Freya strike, Stark. I hope you're happy. Christ. All right. Uh, jungle Explorer, Polyglot, or Impetus. I think it's Polyglot. Yeah. Over Impetus. I just... Especially now that you don't have any friends. Ah, I'm so alone in the world. <laughs> uh, okay. And of course, we have nothing to donate because we didn't do anything except just get a bunch of people lost in the desert last time. I'm gonna do a grassland just because I think that's probably a better choice, right? Than doing now that we desert. lost our main tactical advantage. Yes. Yeah. Precious idol, native settlement. We actually could do that, so I'll take it. Do we want to take a diplomat or a soldier? I'm inclined to take the diplomat because he's not a kleptomaniac. Yeah, and I don't think a soldier's going to keep us alive in a combat situation right now. That's probably valid. Okay, so local outfitter for all the good it will do us. Chocolate for days. <laughs> if your idea of for days is... What? I, uh, I think I just recruited two people when I wasn't supposed to be able to. Oh. Alpha, what are you going to do? Right. <laughs> Either that or it was just like a... A random chance. No, I think it bugged out because it gave me the opportunity to go back in and purchase equipment again at the end. Alpha! Alpha! <laughs> <laughs> um, it's all good. It makes a very challenging game slightly less challenging, which is fine with me. Uh, rotten crates, I will take all of that. Holy shit! Holy shit, oh yeah. God, I might be okay. Oh, I might be fine. All right, we, might, gonna, we might yet make it I'm through I'm going to mount up on this camel, first of all. I'm going to steal everything from these people because these are sacrificial offerings and, frankly, I could use a waterfall. Um, <laughs> sacrificial offering to us, thank you very much. Yeah, right? And I've got the drums, which is almost as good as more food. Yeah, they're not happy. Um, yeah, but I'm, we don't have much to trade anyway. Also, I'm going to steal that idol because that was my mission. <laughs> so I'm going right, to rest in the village. Of course, they don't trust you. Uh, yeah, sure. You may have a look at my drums. I'm so glad, because now I'm going to steal your item, and then I'm going to run. <laughs> it would be wise never to return to this place. Gee, you don't say. Okay, uh, we'll promote the Scottish yeah, we're, warrior. We're going to need that. They might be hunting us oh down God, now. They're definitely going to hunt us down. Uh, I have to get out of here somehow, so I'm going to go this way. See what's up up here. Yep, there we are. There's the... Okay. All right. All right. It's Native Warrior, Native Warrior, and Native Scout. So we kill the Scout first. Right? No, kill the warriors. You think they have, so? They have better stats. They have slightly less health, but they... See how they have a, a shield die and an attacking die? Oh, yeah. I guess yeah. if they had the uh, the eye and brain, then... Then that's the shamans, and those are totally worth attacking first. Yeah, Those are the yeah. guys that I always get rid of. I'm just going to go ahead and roll this, because I don't quite want to spend all of it on... That looks like that's all I can do. If I do this... Gotcha. All right, there nice. we go. Very nice. Yeah, just like a little bit of optimization. Slight amounts of optimization. Did our camera die? Yes. Are we'll, we still we'll, recording? We're still recording. We'll, we'll pause real quick while I swap out the we camera. We will pause while you swap out the camera. Mm. Are you scowling at the situation? I am. Yeah, because we just pissed off the villagers like a lot. We're at neg six. I just killed a whole bunch of them. And these guys are injured, which means I have to oh my. heal them. Even my camel is injured? That doesn't seem likely. I am two items overburdened. I will create a waterfall. Okay, over there. And I <laughs> Did will... it arbitrarily choose where it, it happened? It did, in fact, yes. It's a little awkward. Makes that not so useful. Use that. And this is going to cost me 95 sanity to travel all the way over here. So, yeah, I do get the feeling that traveling while overburdened is just kind of a bad choice. Yeah, I think basically what it's useful for is if you are, say say you find the pyramid, right? <laughs> and there's shrines around it. You could mm -hmm. probably just like loot up on the shrines, overburden uh, yourself, yeah. and then dip and out then with extra like, stuff. Yeah, so if we ever get that like uh, uh, the water shrine temple area again, we could potentially do that. Mm -hmm. uh, I will rest overnight here. Uh, we were at the brink of collapse. A young native was struggling to fend off a vicious beast. Yes, I will help. 
That's a crocodile. Oh my. I can't even, it's also covering, the art is covering the- uh, The name, which I think is crocodile. Alpha. Oh my God, it deals two damage. Or it, it has two dice and one of them has- of attacks. Yeah, one of them has a tail swipe, which I'm willing to bet is like two damage to everyone. Which would just yeah, kill probably. some members of my party. But we're gonna try it regardless. Because, you know, we like it's to not help. every day you get to fight a crocodile. Yeah, it's not every day that you have to help a young native fend off a, a vicious, um, whatever this is. <laughs> Animal of some type. Oh, and yep. yes, wow. okay, you... everyone's dead. <laughs> oh my God, we're so fucked. All right, but see. you called it. Both it was exactly I two damage to everyone. Kept that goddamn fucking. Up, oh, ah, you got, got it. it. Oh, Ooh. okay. All right, I'm gonna take the crocodile skin. It is still bloody and emits a disgusting stench. Good for trading. I, I wonder will... if that means that you're also more likely to get uh, hunted by other animals because it's like stinky and like. Yeah, that's possible. All right, well I'm gonna eat these cocoa leaves. Uh, what? I don't know what just happened there. Alpha happened. <laughs> Feels like the game's a little buggier. Um, Freya Stark was able to understand their language. I'm going to invite them to the camp. We will trade with them because they are friendly and they don't... It looks like this doesn't give you nearly as much as it did the last well, time. Well, our diplomat's also level one. I'm going to trade these teeth to them because we know that they're functionally useless. Wow, yeah. And I'm going to take the spears because we know that those are useful. We're about to rest and gain a shitload of health, so I don't need the, the mangoes. That's true. And I will just take too many puppets then. Sure. Try and take a mango. Okay. I'll Bam! Take a mango. Wait, if I don't take a mango... Maybe I can generate standing. Bingo. Oh. Bingo. I'll take four instead of those, and yeah, I'll, just, yeah. I'll just do that. That's fine. I think that's smart. That seems fine to me. Um, so oh. maybe now they won't hunt us as much? Nope, we're still at negative five. Oh. Because we killed an animal, even though it attacked us. And we saved a native. Yeah, yeah. right? You'd think that would help, but Bullshit. no. Whatever, it's fine. Fuck them. All right, uh, I think it's probably going to be over here. We're going to have to fight through at least two groups of natives to get there. Good. Let's do it. Good. <laughs> All right, let's do it. Let's see what happens. Uh, this is what's happening. Oh, fuck. All right, so this... Oh, my. I'm gonna huff a guy, and then I'm gonna shoot a guy, and he's dead. Okay. I'm gonna roll that. I'm gonna roll that. Could be worse. Could be better. Could be better. <laughs> oh, there's a shaman. Oh. Wait. Oh, that, that, is, that is the guy I was hitting. All right, I don't feel so bad. I feel like if I, like, didn't know about it, I should feel worse than if I did. I don't know. Um, <laughs> I agree. No, I got a guy. Nope, no. Maybe I... if you use the spears, you could... No, not anymore. The spears have a really specific uh, damage die to them, remember? Oh. They've got that, that one that's like, all right, so I do this. I'm going to do that. I'm going to do this. I'm going to do that. Oh, okay. There we go. I'm going to do this. Nice. Got him. All right, wow. cool. Perfect. Ooh, wow. Okay. Uh, oh, wow. Oh, wow. Ooh, you're going to need that red mushroom. Well, I'm going to take the spear. I'm going to take the red mushroom. I'm going to take those two because I'm going to eat them right away. And I'm not going to take the coca leaves. So first, I'm going to eat this. I could give this to anyone. I think whatever your best warrior is. Campbell. Okay, afterwards he was miraculously healed, and he didn't develop any unusual disorders as a result of it. Nice. Which is, I mean, yeah, that's a, that's a win in my book. Um, let's try and just continue up this way and see what happens. We get attacked again, that's what happens. Fuck! All right, uh, okay, here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. Um, first I do this, then I do that, then I do this, then I do wow. spear defense. Wow. Wow. Wow, that's a good attack. Yeah, I do think that they made some new combos Which since we last played. I'm glad for, but at the same time, I'm kind of bummed about because, no, it looks like, oh, there is another shaman. Okay. So I will kill that guy then. Aim shot for sure. Spear doesn't do anything, still doesn't do anything. Now it does something, and it does four, which is too much, but okay. Yeah, it's it, still worth I it. I mean, yeah, it's worth it to kill the shaman, because otherwise he's going to sit there just healing up his guys, and half my party is dead. Half of my party is dead. Yeah. Shit, the 
this is gonna go badly. All right, I'm gonna just use the spear because I kind of have to. All things considered, I still really love the the damn the like combat system. I love in this the game. way I love the way the combos work. Yeah, it's really exciting. And it's uh, the way that they have it set up now too is is really smart. I feel like it's really easy for them to add new things to it. Yes, I agree. Um, that it's it's modular and that's kind of important. I think. Mm -hmm. Shit, I think I just died. No, I didn't. Okay, I'm good. Wow, you were super close to death, I but... I am super close, but I have him. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm going to take it all. I'm going to eat this red mushroom. I'm going to give it to Freya Stark. In, Rapid wound healing went into a trance. In the old version, if um, you fled from a, a combat, would you always leave your injured behind? No, uh, you would not always leave your injured okay, behind. Okay, so that's... Sometimes leave your injured it's, behind. So far, it seems like it's happened every time. Yes, it does um, seem like that. <laughs> which, honestly, I think that's, that's sort of a good thing. Yeah? Um, it makes perfect sense, right? Okay, yeah, I'll give you that. And leave your injured behind. That basically... Um, I don't know. I, I think it makes. Who? 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 I just died. Oh. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I kind of saw that coming. Did, you you kind of had to see that coming too, right? I didn't. No, I was like, I'm fine. I have all of my stats and all of this equipment, and then I just got murdered by natives. I figured okay, if, uh, if they hadn't killed you, the next one would have. So, all right, uh, let's 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 have a brief discussion about this because I think this is important. So, last time in the in the exit screen, we talked about how part of the fun of this game was the fact that it is pretty difficult to figure out, and that yes. it encourages exploration. So, uh, we are four updates past the last game, and. Uh, we did not really do a whole lot of exploration this time. This time I sort of assumed I knew what was up, and it just kind of proceeded through the game, and I died three times in, it's been like, it, like how much, like two hours? Like what, yeah, not even? Only, so, only about three hours. Uh, yeah, I, I, I think that the game has, every update it seems like sets the game back for every player, back to the, the, the phase where they were beginning. You have to <laughs> sort of carefully explore. Yeah, and, and this is really exciting. I, I really like the updates they've made. It feels much better. I, I agree. I think yeah. that all, all around, it's it's a lot better polished. And you you said we didn't explore a lot in the beginning, but I actually disagree. Um, we did. We, yeah. All right. We, the first we one. Entered, I'll give you that. Yeah. We entered in this this playthrough of mm -hmm. it, um, thinking that we still understood how everything worked, right? And then we got killed. But a lot of new elements were thrown at us, even mm -hmm. though we weren't looking for them. True. And after that, that's when we were like, okay. Maybe this works the same? Let's find out. <laughs> All right, so uh, the the combat is a little different. Um, the, the injuries remaining persistent, that's a new thing. Mm -hmm. That didn't used to happen. Uh, if you lost a guy, in, or if you had a guy fall down in combat and get injured, then afterwards, he would, now you know what, he would be injured, but it wouldn't be such a big deal. It wouldn't have his health, and I think that's what it was doing. It was, it was like cutting the, the health of them in half so they'd be uh. easier to die later the next time. This is, uh, uh, it's still a good game. That's the thing, is that it, it feels like a, a, a slightly different game, a more difficult game, because the, it was easy to, it was pretty it, easy to skate through. Yeah, uh, in, in last time. version 16, I think is when we last played it. Yes. I, I feel as though it and was... I played it on version 13 before it, that. So yeah, so, so I think it was, it was difficult, right? But it was also easy to figure out and then break and exploit. Yes. Yeah, it was, um, it was... And even the way we ended the last episode of, of our last playthrough yeah, was we're just kind of like example we of just kind of boogied and we still got second place and yeah. we just like just mm, like sort of fucked it well, like yeah we're screw out. dinosaurs yeah uh, no this time uh, we were on mission five and we died we were on mission one and we died twice um, this is a it's still a a challenging roguelike exploratory. A game. This is mm -hmm. it, it's still exactly on message with where it was before. It's just a little bit harder to fake your way through, which I yes. think is an improvement, honestly. So it, even though we haven't finished a playthrough this time, I think it's a better game. Right? I, I I agree. Um, I think now because of the way that it is, mm -hmm. I think earning your victory it 
feels that much more rewarding. Oh like my god, you, yeah. You really earned it. Like I'm gonna go I'm gonna go home and I'm gonna try this <laughs> and I'm gonna get it until I get it. And when I finally get it, it's gonna be like it's gonna be a big victory moment. And then they're gonna have more updates and Oh then... for sure. And then and then and then the game's gonna hit full release and it's gonna be like photorealistic graphics like we talked about. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Just ditch all this pixel shit. Uh no, this is uh uh this is this is more and more fascinating. I love the Halloween update. I love the addition of H.P. <laughs> Lovecraft as a character. Like, if you're gonna have, if you're gonna have Freya Stark and Frederick Courtney Sellis and uh, Marie Curie in the game, that you have to have H.P. Lovecraft in the game. He's one right. of their contemporaries. Right. <laughs> it's it's perfect. It's hard as hell to play him, but it's perfect. It is really hard to play as him. But I feel like those metal cubes. Once I figure out what they do, those mm-hmm. will be really rewarding. Yeah, there's there's certainly a certain play style in mind for yeah, him. There's, that we I have mean, to it's, out. it's still clear that there are various play styles that you're intended to adopt. It's just, it's less clear how you get those. Like those later characters, we were looking at the menu in between camera switches. I don't know if that's going to make the final cut or not, but we were talking about how the way that you get various characters has changed mm-hmm. since the last time we played. Where whereas the last time, in order to unlock Alistair Crowley. You needed to walk like through a hex that was on fire, and you had a pretty good chance of losing a party member. But this time, you just have to finish a game with good standing, and that's like. Ah. And especially for him, it doesn't make as much sense, you it know. Feel as good. I right, like right? fire. Bring back the fire machine and mensch. But aside from that, I mean, I, I I have no real complaints. The game is still really fun. Yeah, and obviously there are the bugs here and there. Oh, but for sure, but who cares? It's, it's alpha. It's alpha, it's early access. It's okay. Like It's an indie game on Steam. You should expect bugs, and if they enhance your experience, then that's why you played an, a game in alpha on Steam. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. yeah. And, and all things considered, it doesn't ever stop the game from being fun. So. No, 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 definitely not. It's, it's definitely... It definitely remains an engaging experience, even though we did lose pretty hard three times. I I, I call this a success. Yeah. I consider it yeah. a success. We will definitely come back to this when it hits beta, and we will definitely come back to this when it hits alpha. And if there are updates in between, we'll come back to it again. This is a fun game. I enjoy playing it, and I like playing it for you guys. So if you had fun, <laughs> let us know. Uh, if there are things that we should have tried in the game, leave a comment. If you'd like to see a game or a strategy tried in the future, let us know again in the comments. Uh, There is no better way to show your support than liking or commenting. Yeah, yeah. I completely agree. That's all I got. So uh, I guess we'll see you in the archives. Yeah, thank you everyone for watching, and uh, we'll be sure to let you know when we start another playthrough. For sure, for sure. (laughs) We will will definitely be playing this game again. This This is not the end. We'll see you next time. This is a fun game. Like, even when you die, it's fun. I wish we'd gotten, uh, like, a volcano death at some point. That would have been fun. That would have been good. Just fleeing from the, the burning jungle is always a good time.